photos can be deceptive. You get attached to a place. Every home has its own personality. Doesn't feel as big on the inside. <laughs> That's one I'm not used to hearing. <laughs> Well, it's more than big enough for me. Generous room sizes and storage space. Is it just you? At the moment, yes. Since losing my husband. Plenty of space to rattle around. <laughs> Children grown up, moved away. Location is hard to beat for school catchment area. I don't have any children yet. Well, you have to think of them too. You never know what's on the horizon. You said this closely fits my criteria. Prime location. The view is spectacular. That's got to be one of its optimum USPs. One thing I shall miss is overlooking the park. Certainly looks impressive in the brochure. Nice bit of trees, greenery. Yeah, you like a view, do you? Who doesn't like a view? There's some beautiful plain trees down there, if you look out from this window. This redevelopment's worrying. Bound to obscure it sooner than later. It was never as built up as this. Up and coming area. Everyone likes a view. Been on the rise quite a while, I hear. Market buoyant to get in. There's never been a better time, to be fair. Has it been on the market long? Doesn't seem five minutes since. One of our most recent acquisitions. It'll be a shame to have to move, really. I hope you don't mind me calling round. Oh, no, no, not at all. It's nice to have some company. Shall I put the kettle on? Uh, were you thinking to put an offer, uh, offer in? I don't think I've seen enough yet. Shall I give you the grand tour? Allow me to show you round. I meant properties. Shall we start with the lounge? We do have plenty more on our books. Has there been much interest? <laughs> A property like this doesn't hang around. Surprising how much room with a three-piece. You're the tenth client to view today. Oh, there's not much coming up that suits my needs. I don't think anyone's moving until they know what's what. I'll tell you what, let's put a date in the diary and I'll personally escort you around three or four properties that I feel fit your optimum requirements. Oh, you've nothing on your books that appeals to me. Oh, come now, I think I can find something to tick most of your boxes. Yes, but it's all my boxes that need ticking. It's such a big decision, and you're always made to feel so rushed, aren't you? Have there been any offers? It's gone to sealed bids. I think the view should sell it alone. Do you take sugar? Oh, yes, one thank you. But the good ones don't tend to hang around. Ain't that the truth? It's just a case of picking the best one to suit my needs. I do like a glossy brochure. Well, most of our sales are done online these days, to be fair. Well, are they far off the asking price? Oh. I've no idea on present day value. I'm sure you'll be pleasantly surprised. This area has really rocketed recently. What about the maintenance? The lifts are in working order and the gardens are regularly maintained. I don't have the exact figures to hand, but it's nominal. What do you mean by nominal? A couple of grand? Shame the third bedroom's so pokey. The box room has been a storage den forever. One seems to accumulate such a lot of things over the years. Make a nice little office or, or nursery. It's perfect for a nursery. Oh, do you have children? Well, do you have a partner at all? My uh, partner, my ex-partner. Well, he's um, he's just informed me that. Uh, well, he's just told me that he won't be leaving his wife after all. So. Oh, oh, I am sorry. I'm just looking for myself primarily. I could uh, quite fancy this as a bachelor pad since my divorce. Don't you ever get tired of looking around other people's homes? Not at all. It's our bread and butter. So this is more of a two and a half bedroom, really. When were you thinking of putting it on the market? When I'm ready. I mean, I don't want to jump on the first thing that I find. You don't want to lose out through procrastination either, do you? Look, here is my card. And my number's on there. Give me a call. My daughter says I can move in with them. But it... She's got her own family to think of. I'm sure you'll find somewhere just as nice. But I do need to find something fairly soon. I'll leave a brochure with you for you to look through in your own good time. Well, how long have you lived here? Oh, goodness. Oh, now you're asking uh, 35 years, I think. He's a little tired, to be fair, but of course that is reflected in the asking price. Does look well looked after. I've always been house proud. I've enjoyed my time here. Oh, the presentation is fairly good. There wouldn't be too much to do. Oh, the kitchen will have to be ripped out to start again. Same with the bathroom. It's expensive. Mm. Will you have a cup of tea or coffee while you're here? Oh, that's very kind of you, but I'd better get to my next appointment. They're really lining them up for me today. I mean, I like it, but there's a lot that needs to be done. So I'm going to pop back on my own and have another little look, if that's OK. You did good. <laughs> you take your time. Ask me anything you like. Will you be making a decision in the next week or two? My husband, my late husband now, he was very fond of this area. He used to take Betsy, our terrier, for a daily walk in the park. I don't know which I miss most. 
If I haven't heard from you, um, I'll, I'll give you a courtesy call early next week. It's my card. My number's on there, don't hesitate. So you'll let me know about the market value by post? Yes, I'll write to you with a guide price to what I feel the present market can stand. I see. Very good. The agent tells me it's gone to seal bids. Did he? Well, I wouldn't know anything about it. They never tell you anything, do they? Well, goodbye, Mrs Robertson, and thank you so much for allowing me to evaluate your beautiful home. My pleasure. Thanks for coming round. I hear you might be open to an offer. Well, here we are then. Do come in. I'm glad the key's working. So, it's just yourself you're looking for, I take it? Photos can be deceptive. You get attached to a place. Every home has its own personality. Doesn't feel as big on the inside. <laughs> That's one I'm not used to hearing. <laughs> well, it's more than big enough for me. Generous room sizes and storage space. Is it just you? At the moment, yes. Since losing my husband. Plenty of space to rattle around. <laughs> Children grown up, moved away. Location is hard to beat for school catchment areas. I don't have any children yet.